Hello everyone, this is Yamin and welcome to Laravel e-commerce project tutorial for beginner. So in this tutorial, we are going to add sweet alert confirmation message whenever someone click on the delete button. And when someone confirm delete, only then it will delete that certain data. So in order to integrate or in order to add the sweet alert confirmation message, we need to first of all search over here, tweet alert CDN link, then press enter. Then go over here, cdns.com and from here, we need to copy this to the last CDN link. So here you can see copy, skip that. So we need to copy this and after that, we need to go to this blend file. So right now we'll go to our code and here you can see category.blend.php over here. We are showing the category name also the delete button. So we'll just directly go down and here okay let me just say it over here here at the end of the body deck here you can see at the end of the body deck we're going to add a serial link over here so here you can see script this is the serial link for suite alert so after this what we need to do is here you can see we have the delete button inside the ivor tag so here, what we are going to do is, we are going to mention a on-click event. So we we'll say here on-click equal to, we need to mention a function name. Let's say confirmation, then we'll give to first bracket. And in this two first bracket, let's say here event. Let me just show you what we did. We just write this on-click confirmation event in our anchor tag. So after this, what we will do is we will go down and here we are going to write a script for this function confirmation. So we will say here script and in this script we are going to say function confirmation then to first bracket then ev then to second bracket. So here you can see confirmation ev. This is basically this one, confirmation, here you can see we write event. We'll just say over here EV in a short form. So first of all, whenever someone click on this delete button, it will call this function. And here in this function, what we do is first, we'll say over here EV dot prevent default. We'll say this. So what this will do is whenever someone click on the delete button at the beginning, it will stop the browser from reloading or refreshing. So after this, we need to get the href link. So here you can see href link, delete category, dollar data ID. So we need to get this in this function for it. Let's declare a variable. Let's say bar URL to redirect. You can declare the name anything you want, but we'll go with this song. Then we'll give a equal sign. After that, we are going to mention this EV. Then we'll give a dot, we'll say here current target dot. Then we need to say get attribute, attribute. And after this, we'll give to first bracket and inside it, we are going to say h rail. So, what it will do is that it will get the URL from here and store it in this hard URL redirect variable. And if you want to print it in the console, you can do that as well. For it, you need to say here console.log to first bracket and if we just say this and write it over here it will print in the console so it will print the link in the console url link basically this one so after this what we will do is we are going to make some text and design for the sweet alert so for it we need to say hwal then to first bracket to second bracket like this and in this sweet alert we need to give some title. So let's say here title clone to double quotation and we we'll say are you sure to delete this? After that, we need to give a comma. Then we we'll send here text and here we're going to send this delete will be permanent. Then since this is a delete, let's give it awning side so here i'm going to add a icon and the icon will be awning then again comma and we are going to add some buttons so we we'll say here buttons buttons there it takes yes and it will be true and for this do not give any single quotation or double quotation and this will be the last one we we'll say here danger mode it will be true 
and this is the design and text for the suite alert so right now let's say uh, if someone click cancel option for suite alert then or they will do whenever someone click cancel so for it here we need to give a dot then we will say here then then we will say will cancel first bracket then this is greater than sign and here we need to give two second bracket like this and for this then we'll have a first bracket over here and the first bracket will end over here and at the end we need to give a semicolon and here we are going to give a condition if we'll cancel we'll give to second bracket we'll say window dot location dot href equal to you are going to mention this variable you are going to redirect we'll just paste it here and those are all the code is necessary for creating the suite alert confirmation button if we now save then if we now refresh over here then let's click on this makeup option if i click on this delete button there you can see it is showing us a awning icon then are you sure to delete this that delete will be permanent if i now click cancel there you can see it keep us on the same view because here we mentioned window.location.hf equal to urn redirect it means it will keep the user on the same view but if we click on this delete then click ok the page will reload and then you can see that data is deleted so this is how you can add the sweet alert delete confirmation message in laravel if you have any question problem or suggestion just let me know in the comment section make sure to subscribe and i hope to see you in the future tutorials